Okay, so... I mean... I will say for, the, for a fact that... <clears throat> I will say for a fact that... We'll have to see how... This match ends up doing. <clears throat> Let's see how this match ends up doing here. We have number four in the power rankings, Lex Luger, with his manager Bobby the Brain Heenan versus Booker T. Let's do this. Recording? Yes, we are. Okay. All right. It's always good to check these. I will say that. All right. So again, worth pointing out. This is not Super Brawl. This is Starcade. <laughs> Theory, no. I got this Super Brawl. I realized this when I started recording. Anyway, anyways, we have we have Booker T. You're probably wondering what's what's going on with Stevie Ray. Isn't it 1995? Late 1995? I don't know. <laughs> Am I going to partner him up with Steve Uray? This is a good question. <laughs> I mean, do I want to form Harlem Heat? You know, I'm not going to decide this one. I'm going to let you guys decide. So in the comments, tell me, should I reform Harlem Heat? Alright. I mean, he's facing off against the Narcissist. See ya. <clears throat> See ya. So again. So watch the start of my Starcade video if you want. If you want more detail, I guess. And if you want to watch like a like my in your house video, if you know where the WWF is right now, go watch that. Alright. Enough of shameless self self promotion. Enough of shameless self promotion. Let's just do this. <clears throat> There's Booker T. And there's Lex Luger. <clears throat> so here we are, United States Champion. The total package, Lex Luger with Bobby the Brain Heenan. So yeah, okay. So the thing is, is that... So yeah, obviously, this, as you can probably tell, because this is late 95, you can probably tell that that Lex Luger obviously jumped ship to WCW. Apparently he won the US title along the way too. What a coincidence. <sighs> eh, that's one more achievement than he got when he returned to WCW. Dusty! Ah, yeah, she's foolish. Skip. Skip right into Rumble, guys. Come on. Let's get ready to rumble! I don't know. I can't do I can't do a good Michael Buffer sadly. <clears throat> Let me see Bobby the Brain Heenan. Just uh uh leading helping the total package to victory now a kick off immediately from Luger on that one again a kick there. Oh, and again, a boot. Bobby Heenan. The manager of of the total package. We've seen what Booker T can do in this ring. Well, not yet, anyways, but that's for the future. No one. Close eye in the corner. Booker's gonna go top rope. Not something Booker does often, let me tell you. Oh, a nice elbow. Cover. Even though it looked, it looked like he missed it immediately, but immediately kicked out by the total package. Now, you see that look on Bobby the Brain Heenan? That makes you realize that he's going to do something. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, and again an elbow. Pretty sure now a reversal by Luger, and again... We're seeing Lex Luger go to work here. Again, Luger with a... I mean, we've seen this time and time again, haven't we? Whatever works, works, I guess. <clears throat> I 
And again, we see all the stuff happening now. Booker now with a big time reversal. Lex now. Stared out to both men. It looked like they were going to kiss for a second there. I don't know. Suplex there. So we're going to try to poke him up here. I'll try to at least. One second. <laughs> Sorry. I had to do it. Okay, there we go. There we go. So, indeed. So this is how they all fall, I guess. We become what we behold. There's the pile driver. Sheesh, and he decides not to pin him. How mildly interesting. <laughs> As he goes after the neck of Booker T. Again! The elbow again. Booker T looking looking for a big one and again. Again. Oh no, I just have a habit of saying that. When it comes to grammar. I'm not a genius when it comes to grammar. I'm not a genius at all. No duh. And here we go. Hey, we gotta get something in here. Oh, no spin Rooney? Come on. Like, just do a spin Rooney. Do it for all of us, new spin Rooney. Uh, darn it. Okay, whatever. Just do this. Oof. It was at this moment where you realize is it really worth it? Oh, and a scissors kick! Scissors kick! And a rope break. It always has to end the rope break. Every single time. I mean, you could probably imagine for a Lex Luger match, it's alright. I don't know. Does anyone else remember the time where where people, where people actually cared. Yeah, you can think of the countdown victory for that. So like, you can think of the countdown victory for having it for people not caring, you know. You can think that. Yeah, uh, dude, no one cares about your body and building image, dude. Good example. You pretty much would have lost if it wasn't if you cared about your bodybuilding image. Go. Oh. Just trying to check on him. No. Well. Oh. We are okay, we're eight minutes in, okay. Oh no. The attitude adjustment the adjustment pile driver! By Luger. He's done it before, let me tell you. What's he doing? Oh, come on! One! Two! Oh my goodness! Dirty pin for the victory! Cease the waste. Wow. Yeah, what do you know? So they just stare each other down, close lines them. Yeah, what do you know? Can I just say that he has nothing to celebrate about? I mean, you pretty much beat a lower mid carder at this point. Sure, the lower mid carder become a Hall of Famer, but at this point, you have nothing to brag about. You had to do a dirty pin to beat him. Come on. Well, yeah, uh, we'll see what happens for the rest of Starcade, but. Hope you enjoyed this video, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.